Y'all like Chrome? You like Chromium? You like all the different Chrome-based browsers, browsers that exist? I sounded like I was the, 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 that's all folks. Well, I don't know what that intro was. What I do know is there's a really cool trick that I figured out inside of Google Chrome that many people are just unaware of. I tweeted about this the other week and I was like, oh, I'm gonna make a video, okay, cool. So if you go to any, and I mean any product inside of a Chromium browser that, you know, app wise, you're a little frustrated. The most common one with this is like, why does Google Calendar not have the ability to have an application? Like we're a multi-billion dollar company, same with Gmail, right? You can make it just be its own thing. Like my my Gmail, if I press command space is here, all right? But yeah, seriously, I mean, I just did that. I did it with Google Calendar. What, how, how am I doing this? Uh, Maybe it's cause of that trick I was talking about. Let's make it happen in under a minute. First, you'll go to the three dots in the top right. Then you're gonna go to share and save or save and share, I should say. It used to be under more tools, they changed it. Now we're gonna press create shortcut. And under create shortcut, all you have to do is type in the name and then click open as window and then click on create here. After that, you can simply open up Google Calendar and it pops up like this. Seriously, that's how it works. It's that simple. And if you're on edge, which I know some of you are on edge as a browser and as a person, I feel you in both of those situations. We similarly go to the three dots in the top right, go to apps and then install this site as an app. After that, it will install it in your computer and it'll end up putting it in your Microsoft Edge applications. It's like in the back end, similar to the shortcuts that'll save somewhere, but same thing. I did it with the Gmail earlier. That's how this works. I did it with Coda because yeah, Coda decided to just say, hey, I don't have an application, you stink, be better. Just kidding, it's a great app. But that's how you can do with anything. If you really wanna just have automations and a certain application, if you just really just wanna have, I don't know, your, your school portal in a certain application, just make it a thing. It does have an app and it shows up with the little icon at the bottom as such, right? Like it's, it's like its own app, it's cute. We like it. And we like the fact that you enjoyed this video. So make sure you click the like button and subscribe because I know this was a fun tip for you. And I know you'll like this video on how to improve your skills using productivity tools like this one even more.